Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing question number 30 of the miscellaneous 7 quadrant geometry from the new edition mathematics book. This uh, question were asked, this was question was asked uh, by so many students to do. So I'm uploading this video for this question number 30. So good luck. Uh, given that origin point A and point B and lambda is greater than zero means, please remember this means this is positive. The greater than zero means positive. And we need to find, show that the area of this OAB is this square unit. So, so first target is to find the area. So the area of the triangle, the triangle is O. A, B, and remember, uh, I have already discussed in exercise 7.1 how to find the area. This is O coordinate, like origin A, B, and then again O, and we can find the area. Origin is 0, 0. Then we have A is minus 1 and 1. B is 1 upon lambda and 1 upon lambda squared. And zero, like origin is again zero, zero. So the first method is what we just simply multiply this one like this. And then we write minus and then multiply. So I will just do it now. One upon two with this model sign, zero times one is zero. Minus time is this is minus one upon lambda squared. And this is again zero. And then we have minus of the formula. Now what we need to do, we have to do multiplication like this and let's see what's the result now 0 times minus 1 is 0 1 times lambda 1 upon lambda is plus 1 upon lambda and plus then 0 okay now we just need to simplify now 1 upon 2 and we have like minus minus 1 upon lambda squared and minus 1 upon lambda and what we can do we can make like take minus common is up to you when we take minus common this minus will become positive so when i write this bracket everything is positive now 1 upon lambda squared plus 1 upon lambda now you can also simplify like 1 upon 2 and you can take the lcm here is lambda square and this is 1 plus lambda or you can like like this or even you can write like this and we have done area let me check the answer of the first part the area is coming no sorry the area is here we have proved yes sorry <laughs> we have proved here the area is coming here this is the same done next part is find the Find a b in terms of lambda. Okay, find a b in terms of lambda means what we have to do. We have to find the distance of a and b. Now, let's start. A b, the distance formula like x two minus x one whole square plus y two minus y one whole square. We have to use so b is one upon lambda minus one is plus one whole square plus formula, and then we have minus one. Okay. Now, just we need to like simplify now. We can do one thing here, A, B, because here we can take the LCM first. The LCM is coming lambda and it's coming 1 plus lambda. And here LCM is lambda square and 1 minus lambda square, whole square. Okay. Then we can write 1 plus lambda whole square upon lambda square. And here we can write, this is 1 time plus 1 time minus. So I can write 1 time plus lambda and 1 time minus lambda. And the whole square is also there. So this means this square is the square on this and square on this. And this square is, will become 4. Now. What I can do now, this is in under root. What is common? The common in the root is 1 plus lambda whole square is common here and here. And lambda square is also common. 
So what we have now, this is completely 1 plus this is 1 minus lambda whole square upon this will become only 2. So now this is square, this is square. When we write outside the bracket, it will become like this. It will become like this. Uh, a, B is equal to this square. We write once, 1 plus lambda. And this is only lambda. And in the root, we have this one. So we can also take the LCM now because lambda square can come outside. So this is coming lambda square plus uh, this we can write uh, a square minus 2ab plus b square. So I'm just expanding now. 2ab plus lambda square. Okay, this lambda square again when we write outside is coming just one lambda. This lambda and this lambda is becoming lambda square. This is one plus lambda. This lambda square lambda square is two lambda square minus two lambda and plus one and this is the this like distance of a b i think so we should check the answer now the answer is coming absolutely right this is the answer yes lambda plus one upon lambda square and this we have done good moving to next part is show that the height okay good show that the height from o to the line a b is this okay for this situation uh, i would like to say one thing like we got the here uh, like i can show you the diagram first like maybe this can help you when we have this like i just we don't need to draw the diagram minus one one is something here this is a origin is here here o and when lambda is positive means this should be somewhere else here it can be here so when i join this when i join this and like this and like this so what will happen here when i remove this we don't need this actually what the requirement show that the height from o here this is the height from o which will make always an angle of 90 degree this is called the height and we need to find the height now. Remember, we have also one more formula. Area is equals to half into base into height. And height is this one. This is height. And this is the base complete. So the base is actually what? AB. Okay. So area is equals to half into base into height. And height we need to find area we already have one plus lambda divided by lambda square this is already given here is equals to one upon two base is a b which is here and we got a b is here one we can fight here a b is i am writing here uh one plus lambda upon lambda square under root 2 lambda square minus 2 lambda and plus 1 this is the base and the height is only h and we need to find height now okay let's see very simple when i calculate this this square will cancel this whole will cancel when i shift in left hand side and sorry we have also two here two is also cancelled because two is here okay sorry i did not i forget to write two here two was also there and here is only one everything is cancelled this multiply when we shift in left hand side it will divide and when we divide this and i think so height is coming and we have two here this is we have two height is coming same good so the next part, the next part, let's see. The next part is they're asking to find, hence, okay, hence find the lambda where, for which the height is largest. Okay, this largest height. Uh, actually this topic, the largest height, the largest X, the largest, uh, uh, whatever the largest value, 
for largest value we always need differentiation the differentiation of height divided by if this is height suppose this is height divided by what is in like here lambda so this is actually and this is always equal to zero so you will learn this in chapter number 15 to uh, 17 this is like you have to you should watch my video how and you should watch 15.1 that how we can differentiate this okay let me copy this height is i can write this like this 2 lambda square minus 2 lambda plus 1 and minus 1 upon 2 when you differentiate like this with lambda the power like here this is the differentiation you should uh, read you should watch my video 15.1 2 lambda square minus 2 lambda plus 1 and the power will be reduced by 1 is minus 1 upon 2 minus 1 is 3 upon 2 and multiply by 2 2 is 4 lambda and minus 2 this is the differentiation and i write 0 here the whole value the whole value here will become 0 because when I shift in left hand side so 4 lambda minus 2 when this value live like divide this left hand side is coming 0 is equals to only 4 lambda minus 2 and when I simplify this is coming here uh, 0 is equals to 4 lambda minus 2 and lambda will be equal to 1 upon 2 and we have done it so this is like little bit difficult question in the next video i will be doing question number 31 i hope this this video is useful if you think yes because some students demand me this video to upload so this question is very this is one of the difficult question in miscellaneous new edition mathematics book caie so I hope this uh, this video is useful so uh, like my video subscribe my channel and have a nice day